Hey you guys, welcome back! So, Stell just dropped another music video for another song and this time it's Animo. I was sitting here and waiting so I can listen it and watch it as fast as possible. It's been out 8 minutes right now, so I'm not gonna hold you back for much longer because I'm intrigued as well to see it myself. So, yeah, I mean, I, I, I mean, I don't know what is gonna be his sound with the third song coming out. And also the songs are coming out quite rapidly right now. Anyway, so stop ramble and let's get into the video. Okay, we are going again with a slower song. I kinda like that. The previous song that he released, Diko Masabi, was also on a slower side. So I think for now the room is the only upbeat song. Also, I love this simple view, even though like it's quite a bougie view to have out of your window. But I also have no idea. What are the lyrics? Nothing. But I'm excited and I have never heard this song either. I know that he has performed it live, but I have never watched it, never listened to anything. So this is fresh first like listen and reaction from me of this song and the music video. This seems really emotional, kind of sad maybe, that sad, vulnerable, fragile. And this video as well, for now, like in like color wise, is kind of on darker, on more serious, sadder type. Because everything is dark, blues, blacks, grays. There's not much light yet happening at least. I don't know how this song will progress, but for now it's kind of on pulled back fragile side. <laughs> His vocal is so beautiful, it's so fragile, it's just stunning. Also, this wants to make me want to sing this song as well, because it's so lyrical. The melody is so ballad, so ballad. But it's so, like, not sentimental, but it's like so... I, I don't know how else to explain it than fragile. It's so gentle, without pushing anything to be kind of to himself. It's beautiful and then kind of intimate for him, I feel like. This film seems like an intimate song for him to share with the world. And this piano is also beautiful. I love that this also is more or less just a piano track underneath. It's really stripped, really pulled back. There's not much production, nothing. It's literally like an echo around, like a natural sound around it and piano played really strip pull back which I don't think you really hear that kind of music anymore these days especially like from artists from Stell to come out everything is more like a beat more produced more layers to, like catch in your face but this is stripped and really simple and I would say even more effective because it's just vulnerable and so relatable to people <laughs> Okay, there's like some turns happening because like the sun came out, he smiled for the first time, something is turning. I'm not sure what because I have no clue what he says. I'm just gonna go after his emotion and how he interprets the song. This is gonna be interesting to read the lyrics. Also, let me know in the comments down below if you can. Like summary, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this seems like he basically finally left the room, which is not connected with the first song that he came out with because it's completely different vibes, but he left the room, his building, his like safe space where he has been like reflecting probably on something that has happened. I mean, that's what I get the gist of. I don't know if I'm completely wrong or am I on a track, but it seems like he was in there. He has to like sit with himself to like overthink what has happened and then kind of step outside and like actually see the small things that can make you happy and like fulfill you and it's like as I said like a second fresh breath for him to be like okay I can still go and I can try and I can live and I can don't have to be like sad or like live in a past forever I can look forward yeah I know Ok, 
okay, I think we are going in like bigger chorus maybe here. Um, the build up and the simplicity of these shots what what Stell just showed us. I don't know who made this, who worked on this music video. Again, let's see composer Pablo and Huasa again. This is really cool. Anyways, what I wanted to say is this these scenes that we just saw there is so simple and like people don't really if you strip everything back and you kind of live in a moment and in a piece the sun on your face the wind blowing through your hair to just see like in the distance to see the sceneries to be just i know grateful for, for small things and kind of just kind of live on and you just smile it on the smile with your face you have like another shot in life i guess in a way Oh, but he's crying now. I'm confused now. I don't know then what to expect. Or am I completely wrong about what I, I'm talking right now? This is what I get from the music video. Pain, like a full pain. Like this song is painful for him. Really vulnerable. But like it, it looks like in these lighter parts that like he's coming out of it. And when he was, when he was in this room, he was like locked in with himself. And I would say he's like starting to live again. I don't know. <laughs> Beside what just happened there, like the vocal, he's making songs that like male artists, probably most of them cannot sing this song. Like they will have to go a tone or like a octave lower to be like, I can sing this song, but not like him. He has such a strong, strong vocal. And this music video is throwing me off. I don't know what to expect. It's like, it's two-sided. One is complete pain and like misery in a way. And other one is like happiness and starting and kind of new beginning with the simple things around him. I know I have mixed feelings. I don't know what to think. <laughs> He's literally singing through like tears you can feel that in his voice it must be I cannot imagine recording something like this in front of other people to like show your vulnerability hmm. so confused i love this song but i have no idea what just happened i think i have to check the lyrics because i don't think i have ever been this confused about the song meaning of it and guys the lyrics are so sad and even so i will just hug you don't worry anymore never be alone i will love you forever even if you don't know this is like a love song but like heartbreaking heart song this is like a heartbreaking song like love song i did not expect it because it gave like mixed signals of like it talks about living in a light and in dark in the shadows and and the other person will never be alone because he always says like the person is mine wow this is, i don't know even if this is correct lyrics i think it is let me know in the comments down below because like this is tough this is really hard emotional thing that he singed about there wow i will wow this is really really deep i didn't know what to expect from this song but this is uh also vocally quite a strong song to sing to especially if you full put a full-on emotion of yourself to sustain yourself even when he sings there you can hear the like almost like shakiness of like crying like you're just like on a breaking point when you just sing these words if that means to you and it can reflect on you it can be really meaningful and dig up some deep deep emotion there i mean the video was beautifully made it was simple but it was beautiful i feel like i'm just like kind of like put in like a peace mode like how i started the video hyped around the song and i'm like oh this took a turn that I didn't think about, they would. Anyways, you guys, let me know in the comments down below what do you think about the song, 
about the music video, about the meaning of it, about the visual of it, how they created it. Yeah, I will go probably sit with myself for a moment with this song, listen it again. And also I want to say, as usual, this is a music video, it's probably going to be cut in like pieces. So if you want to see a full music video, head over to my Patreon. But on that, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next one. Bye.